What's up everybody? Welcome back to my laboratory where safety is number one priority and today I'm going to show you pretty cool challenge with matches. We're gonna call it bouncing matches challenge. Let's get to it. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put match over here and then put matches just like that the other one on top of them and the challenge is bounce as many matches as you can on one match on this match. You see I got the match box over here and I just stuck it to the side like this and now I'm gonna bounce on the, all these matches on one match see if it's possible see how many I can do and boom the last one and one you see I'm just gonna put it on top like this boom all set much is right here standing by itself now I'm just gonna lift them up slowly boom looks like they're bouncing oh man I'm shaking a lot right now oh no it's gonna fall ah let's try this again now I'm going to put one match up top like this and then I'm gonna go up the bottom much let's put this closer and I'm gonna get the bottom match again and lift it up slowly and should lock them in oh I lost one Boom, and it worked. Check this out, this is awesome. Let me remove it from the tripod. Check this out, you see how it's hanging on top of a match? Pretty amazing, huh? All these matches hanging on one match. So how many matches I got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve matches. So I challenge you to do more. See how many matches can you do? Pretty awesome, huh? Of course, kids, adult supervision, do not play with matches. Looks like I only lost two of them. Would have been 14 matches if I didn't lose any of them. Well, 12 is pretty awesome anyways. So let's see if I'm gonna touch it. Boom, they all knocked out. Pretty awesome, what do you think? Gonna do it, just put it over and your neck just stick it and check this out. Water. It's pretty funny. Now so you can hold it and drink it for a while till it gets hard again. But also, now, if you need two hands minute, to hold the plate and a fork.